What do you do here at the box office? Is this not a picture? No, this is a... Oh, oh okay. Um, can you repeat the question? Um, what exactly do you do here at the box office? Well, I delegate the various duties. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, the responsibilities of the box office. I schedule the employees. I keep them in line. So what do you think made you distinguished enough to get the position of box office manager? I heard a lot of people were competing for the job. Well, I wish I could say it's because of my talents and my skills and my ability to communicate with the people. But I couldn't tell you. It might have something to do with sleeping my way at the top. But it might not. And what is your opinion on Ryan Sheehy? Who? The box office manager. Oh. Um. We don't. I don't like to. Please continue working, Tyler. Thank you. What would I say about Ryan? The box office manager. The box office manager. I never see him. Um, what do you think of Ryan? He's nice. Sometimes. Could you explain your relationship with Miss Shelby? Me and Miss Shelby have a very torrid love affair. Uh, there's a love affair? No love affair is happening. What are you talking about? I don't know what love affair you're talking about. There is no love affair. Please stop that in my face. Stop. We don't no... like to discuss our personal affairs. There is no personal yes. affair. He is delusional. No personal affair is happening at all. Please get off of me. Please. I love this material. Is this the shirt I bought you? No, you didn't. I bought this. Hey, buddy. Um, sorry I yelled earlier. It's, it's okay. Please stop that. You have a lot of tension right here. I know. Stop. I'm, I'm tense because you're touching me. Hi, can I help? These? You're welcome. You didn't pay for those. It's fine. I can't make the menu come up. It won't come up. Okay, I heard you the first time. I don't think you did. Give it won't come sec. up. Yours is working. Why is yeah, it working? Yeah, mine is working because I'm a good employee. I called some tickets earlier. I want tickets. Uh -huh. What? I'm uh -huh. uh -huh. Can you explain um, what happened earlier today with the uh, Polish woman? She was Polish? Yes, I couldn't quite understand her because she wasn't speaking American. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, okay. Yeah, come on, come on. I'm really in a hurry. Is this I'm racist or something? Is it because I'm Polish? Are you Polish? I'm Polish, yes. Natalia Durkarec, is that, a, is that not a Polish name? What country Could you is that? And frankly, I couldn't understand. She was speaking so quickly with these voodoo gibberish words casting a spell on me, you know, and I... It took all I had to just stay calm. Poland in Europe? I'm gonna kurwa mać, ja pierdolę, zaraz się zaraz nie wytrzymam. Could you please give me a ticket? Were you speaking Polish? No, I was talking to myself in Yoda language. Yoda could you language? please could you please give me I a ticket? I love Star Wars. I believe that I was acting like a stellar employee, like I normally do. Just trying to help her, trying to help her help me. To help her get her a ticket. And I'm appalled. I'm still a little upset. It's starting to come back to me. I did I told myself I wasn't gonna cry, but I might get there. Okay? Is the ticket ready? No, I'm sorry. Are you are you are you kidding? I am not kidding. May I please have my ticket or I'm gonna call your manager for God's sake. I don't really do I am the manager. <laughs> Any closing remarks, Ryan? Well, I have a few words from your friendly neighborhood box office manager. 
Just be nice to that person behind the desk. You never know when you might see him again or around. <laughs>